Studios in New York. It's Late Night with Poonan O'Brien. <laughs> You just can't make this stuff up. With Sandy Rick Durant, the Max Weinberg 7. Now, here's your host, Conan O'Brien. All right, stop that now. <laughs> there are some people that just scream to hear themselves later on TV. That's it. It's no, I have no false illusions about it. They go like, and then later on that night, they're watching it, and they hear, that was me. Yay! But the rest of America, how annoying. Well, class, we got a great show for you tonight. We have a uh, fine program, a lot of fun stuff planned, and I have some interesting television news. I'm going to start off the show with TV is the finest medium. We all know. Uh, <laughs> great. I, I got a radio crowd. Yeah. Well, uh, big news in the world of television. The Fox network just announced that next month during sweeps, which is the period when all the networks, you know, try and get big ratings during sweeps, Allie McBeal and her female coworker Ling are going to exchange a lesbian kiss. That's true. Feel. Lesbian kiss, yeah. And uh, I, for one, I'm just hoping that CBS doesn't get the same idea, because I really don't want to see Mike Wallace slipping morally safer the tongue. I don't want to... No need to act that one out, I guess. You've all thought of it before. A, uh, there's a new book coming out. You're going to like this. A new book uh, claims that in 1972, George W. Bush was arrested for cocaine possession, but his father pulled strings to make the arrest go away. That's what a new book says. That's right, and uh, the book also claims that in 1972, Al Gore's father pulled strings to make Gore walk and talk. <laughs> which, which is uh, something you should know. Speaking of uh, presidential elections, Donald Trump is in the news. Donald Trump is releasing a brand new book to capitalize on all the attention uh, his presidential campaign is receiving. He's got a new book, and it's, it's coming out soon. And apparently the new book is called Chicks I'd Nail If I Were President, and, uh, which you want to check out. Uh, finally, last thing I'll mention, I've got a little uh, movie industry. Uh, news for you. It has been reported that the sequel to the movie Basic Instinct, you all remember that movie, the sequel to the movie Basic Instinct is going to be filmed without Sharon Stone because she demanded too much money. So the sequel will not have Sharon Stone in it. Yeah, in fact, in fact, to save money, Stone's part will be played by a leg model and a small otter. Now, uh, should, um, Don't know why that's the case. Uh, all right, let's talk about tonight's show. Fine program for you this evening from Sabrina, the teenage witch. And of course, she's a, a staple. She's a regular part of the new Hollywood Squares. Very funny woman, Caroline Ray, is on the show. Very funny. She's always fun. It's in her contract. We also have from Law and Order. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, this guy single-handedly, like, boosted the ratings on this show, something like 30%, so we could use him here. Uh, 
Uh, he's, uh, he's a great actor. Uh, very cool to have him here. Jesse L. Martin on the show. He's the man of the hour. And then a uh, very funny, very funny comedian, Greg Giraldo, going to perform for you. And right over there... <laughs> just got his penitentiary haircut, Jimmy Vivino and the Max Weinberg 7. Jimmy!